Nicomedia, Greek, Nicomedia, Nicomedia, modern Izmit was an ancient Greek city in what is now Turkey. In 286 Nicomedia became the eastern and most senior capital city of the Roman Empire chosen by Diocletian who assumed the title Augustus of the East, a status which the city maintained during the Tetrarchy system 293 the Tetrarchy ended with the Battle of Chrysopolis in 324, when Constantine defeated Licinius and became the sole emperor. In 330 Constantine chose for himself the nearby Byzantium which was renamed Constantinople, modern Istanbul as the new capital of the Roman Empire. History It was founded in 712 11th BC as a Megarian colony and was originally known as Astacus, ancient Greek, Astacus, lobster. After being destroyed by Lysimachus, it was rebuilt by Nicomedes I of Bithynia in 264 BC under the name of Nicomedia, and has ever since been one of the most important cities in northwestern Asia Minor. The great military commander Hannibal Barca came to Nicomedia in his final years and committed suicide in nearby Libyssa. The historian Arian was born there. Nicomedia was the metropolis and capital of the Roman province of Bithynia under the Roman Empire. It is referenced repeatedly in Pliny the Younger's epistles to Trajan during his tenure as governor of Bithynia. Diocletian made it the eastern capital city of the Roman Empire in 286 when he introduced the Tetrarchy system. Persecutions of 303 Nicomedia was at the center of the Diocletianic persecution of Christians which occurred under Diocletian and his Caesar Galerius. On 23 February 303 AD, the pagan festival of the Terminalia, Diocletian ordered that the newly built church at Nicomedia be razed, its scriptures burnt, and its precious stones seized. The next day he issued his first edict against the Christians which ordered similar measures to be taken at churches across the empire. The destruction of the Nicomedia church incited panic in the city, and at the end of the month a fire destroyed part of Diocletian's palace, followed 16 days later by another fire. Although an investigation was made into the cause of the fires, no party was officially charged, but Galerius placed the blame on the Christians. He oversaw the execution of two palace eunuchs, who he claimed conspired with the Christians to start the fire, followed by six more executions through the end of April 303. Soon after Galerius declared Nicomedia to be unsafe and ostentatiously departed the city for Rome, followed soon after by Diocletian. <laughs> Later Empire Nicomedia remained as the eastern and most senior capital of the Roman Empire until co-emperor Licinius was defeated by Constantine the Great at the Battle of Chrysopolis in 324. Constantine mainly resided in Nicomedia as his interim capital city for the next six years, until in 330 he declared the nearby Byzantium which was renamed Constantinople the new capital. Constantine died in a royal villa in the vicinity of Nicomedia in 337. Owing to its position at the convergence of the Asiatic roads leading to the new capital, Nicomedia retained its importance even after the foundation of Constantinople. A major earthquake, however, on the 24th of August 358, caused extensive devastation to Nicomedia and was followed by a fire which completed the catastrophe. Nicomedia was rebuilt, but on a smaller scale. In the 6th century, under Emperor Justinian I, the city was extended with new public buildings. Situated on the roads leading to the capital, the city remained a major military center, playing an important role in the Byzantine campaigns against the Caliphate. In 451, the local bishopric was promoted to a metropolitan see under the jurisdiction of the Ecumenical Patriarchate of Constantinople. The metropolis of Nicomedia was ranked seventh in the Notitiae Episcopatum among the metropolises of the Patriarchate. In the 8th century the Emperor Constantine V established his court there for a time, when plague broke out in Constantinople and drove him from his capital in 746-47. From the 840s on, Nicomedia was the capital of the Tema of the Optimatoi. By that time, most of the old, seaward city had been abandoned and is described by the Persian geographer Ibn Kurdadbi as lying in ruins, with settlement restricted to the hilltop citadel. 
In the 1080s, the city served as the main military base for Alexios I Komnenos in his campaigns against the Seljuk Turks, and the First and Second Crusades both encamped there. The city was briefly held by the Latin Empire following the fall of Constantinople to the Fourth Crusade in 1204. In late 1206, the Seneschal Thierry de Luz made it his base, converting the Church of Saint Sophia into a fortress. However, the Crusader stronghold was subjected to constant raids by the Emperor of Nicaea Theodore I Lascaris, during which de Luz was captured by Nicaean soldiers. By the summer of 1207, Emperor Henry of Flanders agreed to evacuate Nicomedia in exchange for de Luz and other prisoners. Emperor Theodore Theodore held. The city remained in Byzantine control for over a century after that, but following the Byzantine defeat at the Battle of Baphius in 1302, it was threatened by the rising Ottoman Beylik. The city was twice blockaded by the Ottomans in 1304 and 1330 before finally succumbing in 1337. <laughs> Infrastructure During the Empire, Nicomedia was a cosmopolitan and commercially prosperous city which received all the amenities appropriate for a major Roman city. Nicomedia was well known for having a bountiful water supply from two to three aqueducts, one of which was built in Hellenistic times. Pliny the Younger complains in his Epistulae to Trajan, written in 110 AD, that the Nicomedians wasted 3,518,000 sesterces on an unfinished aqueduct which twice ran into engineering troubles. Trajan instructs him to take steps to complete the aqueduct, and to investigate possible official corruption behind the large waste of money. Under Trajan, there was also a large Roman garrison. Other public amenities included a theatre, a colonnaded street typical of Hellenistic cities and a forum. The major religious shrine was a temple of Demeter, which stood in a sacred precinct on a hill above the harbour. The city adopted official cults of Rome avidly. There were temples dedicated to the Emperor Commodus, a sacred precinct of the city dedicated to Octavian, and a temple of Roma dedicated during the late Republic. The city was sacked in AD 253 by the Goths, but when Diocletian made the city his capital in 283 AD, he undertook grand restorations and built an enormous palace, an armory, mint, and new shipyards. Notable natives and residents Diocletian Arian Saint George Saint Barbara Saint Pantaleon, Adrian of Nicomedia Anthemus of Nicomedia Arsacius of Nicomedia Cecropius of Nicomedia Juliana of Nicomedia Theopemptus of Nicomedia Theophylact of Nicomedia Michael Picellos, 11th century Greek writer, philosopher, politician, and historian. Maximus Planudes, 13th century Greek scholar, anthologist, translator, and grammarian. Aaron ben Elijah, 14th century Karaite Jewish philosopher. Topic: <laughs> Remains. The ruins of Nicomedia are buried beneath the densely populated modern city of Izmit, which has largely obstructed comprehensive excavation. Before the urbanization of the 20th century occurred, select ruins of the Roman-era city could be seen, most prominently sections of the Roman defensive walls which surrounded the city and multiple aqueducts which once supplied Nicomedia's water. Other monuments include the foundations of a 2nd century AD marble nymphium on Istanbul Street, a large cistern in the city's Jewish cemetery, and parts of the harbor wall. The 1999 Izmit earthquake, which seriously damaged most of the city, also led to major discoveries of ancient Nicomedia during the subsequent debris clearing. A wealth of ancient statuary was uncovered, including statues of Hercules, Athena, Diocletian, and Constantine. In the years after the earthquake, the Izmit Provincial Cultural Directorate appropriated small areas for excavation, including the site identified as Diocletian's Palace and a nearby Roman theatre. In April 2016, a more extensive excavation of the palace was begun under the supervision of the Coselli Museum, which estimated that the site covers 60,000 square meters, 196,850 square feet. Topic: See also 20,000 Martyrs of Nicomedia 
Nicaea (present-day Iznik), another important city in Bithynia, and the interim Byzantine capital city between 1204 and 1261, Empire of Nicaea, following the Fourth Crusade in 1204, until the recapture of Constantinople by the Byzantines in 1261. Earlier, the site of the Nicene Creed as well as the First Council of Nicaea and Second Council of Nicaea. <laughs> 